Someone I knew once described Adamant to me. Adamant is, and always will be, the Order, he said. A guardian on the edge of the Abyss. The lone soul that stares into oblivion and doesn't waver. That's what Warden Commander Clorel tried to be. Well, they all tried to be. I'm told her wardens never wavered. They went to their deaths willingly. They died for us. And Corypheus twisted their sacrifice to make it his own. Lighting is kind of weird here. Uh, we stopped it. We stopped him. We saved most of the wardens. But not all of them. And they died thinking they were doing something good. There's no one to blame but Corypheus. Even Clorel's intentions were righteous. Her desire to protect was so great it led her astray. It's not right. To want to do good. To be good. And have that turned against you. Uh, we could still try? At the end of the day, I guess all we can do is try and hope for the best. You're right. What matters is that we never give up. Clorel made mistakes, but she was a great woman, and she died a great woman. It's not the armor or the trappings of the Order. It's not the joining at the heart of it. All a Warden is is a promise to protect others even at the cost of your own life. Okay, then. Getting real deep with Blackwall. <laughs> Not like that. You said, goes, does he have anything else to say? I think I've mentioned this before, but seriously, Solus needs to go, uh, <laughs> go somewhere else with all those weird paintings. What the heck is that even? It's like a bear hugging a druid with, I don't know. Heard you found something that had to do with wardens. I did. Would have liked to have seen it. Of course you would. You have anything to actually talk about? No. Okay. Nothing right now. Can I? Perhaps in a bit. Can I talk to him again? Of all the things in the world, a demon who wears someone's face. I imagine it makes trusting others risky. Trust is important. Without trust, how would we build alliances or friendships? It's easy to speak well of trust when yours has never been misplaced. Nothing right now. Perhaps in a bit. Right, okay. So, about to get a new mount, despite having a Dracolisk, which is rad. Trust me, we'll, when I say we'll switch out, man, I'm really tempted to buy new mounts. How much gold do I have? That's right, okay. Uh, I mean, yeah. No, I'll probably end up spending all this money in Valroyo. The heck? Is that kitchen? What is this? A note from Skyhold Kitchens. Request for supplies. Potatoes, 500. Flour, 40 sacks. Dried peas, 100 sacks. Salted meat, as much as possible. Willow stitches, 4. To break in the new kitchen hands. Wow. The Inquisition is a, a bunch of fatties. Jeez, so much food. I mean, hold on. Let's go, what does this one say? Yeah, another note from the kitchens. How many times do I have to say this? If it falls on the floor, it's still good to eat, right? Oh, I can't, I can't read it again. Five second rule. It just, uh, yeah, it, that seemed like a lot of food. I guess we are housing an army of some sort. Uh, note from the Skyhold Kitchens again. If I ever find out who put the turnips in the fireplace, I will personally feed them into the meat grinder. This guy, man, he's angry. Once again, please keep the elf out of the elf out of the kitchen. Wait, I'm an elf. Are they talking about me? Racist. And check the sugar daily to make sure it is still sugar and not salt. How is that ever a thing? Had to cook. Uh, okay, well, beneath is written trying to keep this out, followed by an arrow pointing toward a crude drawing of a phallus. Uh, that's pretty funny. There's no the end. I can store an army. Who put this painting here? Wait, is that a painting of a uh, haven? It looks like it. Where am I even going? What the heck? Read how to act for Elden. 
uh, be a total racist. That's what that said. Oh, I could summarize. Look, I'm a speed reader. Pyramids of uh, Parvalon. Ready? It's about pyramids. <laughs> I'm sure some... Oh, I didn't even open that one. I'm sure some of these are useful information. The Folly of General Not Sheraton 5. In the days that followed, to avoid scandal, the appointing of Not Sheraton was claimed a grand tactics. You don't want me reading this. What does this one say? What is green? Green. That's what green is. <laughs> it's a color. It's a pigment. That's a big book, though. I would love to read that one. What the heck is that depiction of? It kind of looks like the um, the, the like medical thing. Oh, gosh. What's the name for that? I'm brain farting. I totally know it, too. And then there's like a pentagram there. Like some type of globe. And seriously, with the spiders, someone needs to come in here and get rid of these cobwebs. It's a pretty cool office, though. I can imagine, like, um, like Dorian coming down here, having this as his office. But seriously, with the spider webs, it's gross. We need a maid down here. And there's more spider webs. What the heck? What is going on, even? Where am I? Wait. Josephine? When did this randomly like open? I don't ever remember. I I guess I do remember a door there, but I don't remember a door there. Like I don't ever remember that door leading to anywhere. I thought it led down into the, uh, the prison. Man, I'm confused now. This book that I've already read, Dorian. You have remarkably little here on early to winter history. All these gifts to the Inquisition, and the best they can do is the Malefica Imperio, trite propaganda. But if you want 20 volumes on whether Divine Galatea took a shit on Sunday, this is evidently the place to find it. <laughs> uh, not to your standards? I see. My library isn't up to your exacting standards. It's alarmingly chaotic. I found a copy of the Orobalian in what seemed to be the Antiban classic section. How scandalous. Someone alert the Magisterium. <laughs> you laugh, but in some places there are punishments for that. Did I see something by Genitivi here? Brother Genitivi? Sworn. What is this about, Dorian? When everyone returned, they told us about your tumble into the Abyssal Rift. You went into the Fade. Physically went in. Are you... All right. I mean, I guess so. I guess the Brother Genitivi thing, isn't that the guy from Dragon Age Origins who was in Haven and found the Urn of Sacred Ashes? Isn't that who that was? And then you go like on like the really weird thing with trying to find out like, oh gosh, what was it? It was like, you go to like Denerum and then there was something there with people that were trying to like impersonate him anyways i think that's what he was referring to i don't want to be too sad here so you know i, I learned so much i learned a surprising amount what happened to the temple of sacred ashes for one regained your memories that's good then i think so you do realize this feat hasn't been performed in over a thousand years corypheus and his contemporaries entered the fade and began the blights in comparison. Uh, I was lucky. You're right. I was fortunate. Indeed. Although there is cause for concern. If you can walk in the Fade, others will try to follow. Who knows what secrets Corypheus has revealed. Not all of them will be as lucky as you. What they could unleash. My advice? Keep this quiet. Let them speculate. Too many will see this as a challenge. Yeah, uh, confused. You don't number among them? It's tempting, but I'm no fool. There are enough idiots in the world who think if they just use enough blood magic, their problems will vanish. It's exactly the sort of thing I want to stop back home. This, this I don't need. What I do need is a copy of the Liberalum. I'll wager I can find Corypheus's real name. If I can prove he was a grasping ankle biter with no family to speak of, the luster would come right off. Wish me luck.
Right. Okay. So that's what he was trying to do the entire time is try to uh, do the uh, what you might call it. Found out Corypheus is real name. I can't believe my father's gall. Oh, that's right. Of course, he couldn't come here to Skyhold. No, that would be too much. But contacting some southern cleric on the sly, much wiser. If this is some venatory connivance, I will be utterly disappointed. I totally forgot about that quest. I should go, as you wish. Let's, uh, where was that, even? Inner Circle. Last Resort of Good Men. Bring Dorian to the Goal and Lantern. Uh, does that, is that even on my map? Like, if I go... That's gotta be in Redcliffe, right? I heard a little rumor about you. Oh? Is that so? Indeed. Someone's been doing some training. As an assassin, no less. Uh, uh, is that a problem? Do you have a problem with that? A problem? I kill more enemies before breakfast than most people do their entire life. <laughs> Proud of being in the Inquisition, I expect. We can rend our garments over the morality of it later. At any rate, if you ever intend to make it an actual profession, do tell me. The Antivan crows have nothing on the Imperium. I know people. Keep it in mind. Right. Okay. I should go. As you wish. Let's go talk to Liliana. Because <laughs> uh, we're, we're going to do his quest. I, I forgot about it and I do want to do it. So we may as well. Inquisitor. I am... I have been thinking. You remember everything now, yes? The explosion at Haven. The Fade. Escaping the breach. In your report, you said Justinia was with you. But only you emerged in the end. Why? Why were you the only survivor? Uh, let's think back to the, the cinematic. I just want to kind of go off of that. I tried to save her. She saved me. I had to save myself. I tried to save her. I think I remember him trying to save her. Demons tore her from me. I couldn't stop them. So you had no time to think. Only to act. Her message to me. <laughs> I failed you too. I'm not sure I understand what that means. Did you say anything else? Anything at all? Please, if you remember. You, you don't understand her own message, do you? Wait. You don't know what she meant either. There are no answers in the fate. Only illusions. A warped mirror. Justinia has never failed me. I was her left hand. Now she's dead. I failed her. Failed this city. Okay. Air. Yeah, what a creepy elf just standing there. What the heck? Reports of fade rifts and demons keep coming. The people are terrified, and it's only getting worse. The only thing that will calm their fears now is the hope that someone out there can save them. You have to be that someone. No one else has any power over the rifts. Seal them. Your legend will spread, and Thedas will learn to trust the Inquisition. Did anybody else see her just sit in the air? That was crazy. Okay, uh, let's hop down here. Whoop. Oh, hey, Solus. Long time no see. Actually, let's talk to Solus. I cannot believe the Grey Wardens could even conceive of such a plan. To seek out these old gods deliberately in some bizarre attempt to preempt the Blight. Uh... Don't forget the demons. It was a good idea. They obsess over Darkspawn. Eh. Yeah, don't forget the demons. And calling the army of demons. That's my favorite part. The demons are nothing. They're a tool. A tool that would have let Corypheus ride roughshod over most of all lay. Even if they hadn't, the entire idea is wrong. The Blight is not something one smugly outsmarts. Forgive me. The entire idea is... unnerving. Right. Do you have anything else to say, Solus? Inquisitor? <laughs> You're addicted to the fade. <laughs> sure. 
Tell me something. Do you care about anything in the world beyond the Fade? Ah. Ah? The Inquisitor turns his hawk-like gaze to me, penetrating deep into my most secret desires. Only not. I care deeply for many things beyond the Fade. Just not you. Whoa! Sassy McSasserton over here. Hey, Baldy, where'd you get that sass from? Uh, tr tread lightly, buddy. You're gonna want to watch that attitude, Solus. Why? Do you have another expert on the Fade hiding around here? Maybe. Are you absolutely certain you won't need me? I volunteered to help Inquisitor. Rattle the bars if you like, but I chose to enter this cage. Wow. This guy. To what do I owe the pleasure? Oh, and now you're friendly? I have done no such thing. I simply see no way to help the elves, oppressed as they are now. Uh. You could teach us. Mahalani, Lasagilan. How many Dalish would listen? Most care little about improving their lives. They already consider themselves perfect, sole keepers of elven law. I might reach a few at most, but you are right. That is more than I reach doing nothing. I suppose I'm just tired of fighting. What are you fighting? What do you mean you're tired of fighting? Fighting what? Did you think I honed my magical skills to impress spirits? I have joined my share of courses, but when I offered lessons learned in the Fade, I was derided by my enemies, and sometimes by my allies. Liar, fool, madman. There are endless ways to say someone isn't worth listening to. Over time, it grinds away. Hmm. That's when you should lean on your friends. Apologies, Inquisitor. I have learned not to do that. This guy. Is there any other things that he's painted in here? Anything from Adamant? Can't tell. Eh, it's hard to tell. Okay. Moving on. Sassy over there really needs to tone down his attitude. Jeez. We'll leave him over there for a while. We'll see, uh... We'll see about him doing his, you know, fade thing. If he can get over the whatever butt hurt he was experiencing. I don't know. I just... Maybe... I, I know what it is. I know what it is. It's because I keep jumping down from the top and landing right on all of his notes. And then looking over and being like, Oh, hey, Solus. How's it going, buddy? Uh, I will accept that report. Thank you. Uh, name of our enemy. According to Dorian, it might be possible to discover who carries... Oh, it's, okay, so this is... Um, Any news on why Corypheus is sending people to explore elven ruins, of all things? No, I suspect he keeps the reason secret, even from his inner circle. So, who should I send on? There's probably the one that's just going to take the least amount of time. Um... Go around him, send an agent to infiltrate his archive. No, let's let's bribe him, right? Because Josephine says that that guy who has that book is expecting a bribe anyways, because that's what they do there, so why not? So let's do it. Uh, Alliance is getting things moving. Uh, I guess Colin... Oh, gosh. Massive hiccup there. I guess Colin is going there. Locate okay, Rise and the Evangeline. Now, let's look at Inferaldin, because I have two things over here that I haven't picked up. Oh, the death of good Sir Ruth. We have a report from a dwarven runner that Warden Ruth has welcomed, was welcomed into a squad of the Legion of the Dead. The group descended into the deep roads and did not return, as is tradition with Legion. All were celebrated before they left. We've received a number of appreciations in Sir Ruth's name. Cool. At Hard in Hightown. Freaking Varric. Amulet for Cole. Let's do that. Go, Leliana. Let's see what we have. Alright. Uh, let's go to Redcliffe. And from there... We'll do Dorian's thing, right? So, world map, uh, hinterlands, we'll go up here. Okay. Let's do Dorian, because we need him. Cassandra and 
Freaking sassy pants. No, not sassy pants. How about just take Sarah? Yeah, why not? I don't I don't actually know if having a team will do anything or not, but this is the team I'm gonna take. Okay. Let's go over to the uh the tavern. It's gotta be the same tavern that was here when we did this before, right? Where, wow, crazy popping. Where we were doing the, you know, you come here to Red Cliff and you are greeted by the mages and all that, and the the the, the Venatory. Yeah, this is the same one. Okay, they all need to be leveled up. We'll do that later.